There are lots of different causes of lower back pain and one of the most common causes is disc issues, a degenerated disc or a painful disc. Historically, we have not had great treatment options for back pain related to a degenerated disc. And one of the most exciting new developments in the world of spine management and spinal treatment is uh, a new procedure called basivertebral nerve ablation. Candidates for basivertebral nerve ablation have had lower back pain for several months and have worked with physical therapy and have not had good improvement in the pain. On MRI scan, they have what are called modic change, which is bright signal on the end plates of the vertebrae, which is the bone right next to the disc. And I think about modic change as just being a manifestation of the degenerative process going on that's seen on MRI. Patients that have these criteria are candidates for basivertebral nerve ablation. And all it really is, is burning the nerve that goes to the disc. We, we know about radiofrequency ablation or burning of the nerve that goes to the facet joint, which is a different nerve and a different area. This is a very specific procedure, which is relatively new. The surgery is done by placing a needle through the skin and actually through the bone called the pedicle down to the bone next to the disc and then burning the nerve that's there. I don't actually do basovertebral nerve ablation. Mostly the pain management doctors do it. And this is a very good example of where working closely with pain management has significant advantages. We can identify patients that we think are better for basivertebral nerve ablation and send those patients over to them. And they may be working with patients for whom interventions that they do have not given lasting relief and send the patients over for surgical evaluation to do surgeries like lumbar fusion or disc replacement or decompression. And it's been a very fruitful relationship. Basivertebral nerve ablation is unique because it's very effective, but also because burning the nerve is permanent. When a radiofrequency ablation is done to burn the nerve that goes to a facet joint, that nerve has a potential of growing back and the pain coming back maybe within a year. What's really exciting about basivertebral nerve ablation is the evidence shows that the duration of benefit is long lasting at, at current literature well beyond five years. So this is a good procedure to consider, a minimally invasive option to address the pain coming from a degenerated disc. And it's a wonderful example of where interdisciplinary care can lead to the best outcomes for the patients.